gonna win them all, it's the club boss Gonna win your kid a doll, it's the club boss We be how they pay it all, it's the club boss We done came, we done clawed, it's the club boss Win, win again and again like I'm club boss Win again and again like I'm club boss Win again and again like I'm club boss And there will never be an end, it's the club boss What's up guys, welcome back to the Claw Boss channel. So before we start today's video, I just wanna thank everybody that has donated to my GoFundMe to help possibly fund the weight loss surgery. I love each and every one of you. You guys, the outpouring of support is honestly amazing and I, I honestly would not be here on YouTube without your love and your generosity and I thank you so much for just being here for me. Whenever I need you guys most, no matter what it is, you guys always step up and help me. And I really do appreciate that. The one thing that really did upset me though, is that I'm getting a few comments, not many, but a few that are saying that, oh, no doctor would say I couldn't lose weight. Doctors don't say that this is all a scam. My doctor physically told me I can't lose weight because of my metabolism. Now, that being said, I have lost weight because I've talked to the personal trainer and I have consulted with him and he told me basically what the doctor said was bull. That if you were to stop eating for an entire week, you would lose weight. No, you know, guaranteed you would lose weight. So I, I kind of think that the doctor is wrong or maybe he just thinks it's urgent I lose weight immediately because of my size, because losing weight, doing the gym and dieting is not gonna be as quick as bariatric surgery. So maybe he just thinks there's an urgency there. I don't know. I could physically call him and ask him why he said that and record it and put it on a video. I don't know what you guys want me to put because I don't know why I would make up a lie like that or why I would even think that. But the doctor physically told me that it's impossible for me to lose weight. And at that time, it scared the hell out of me. The personal trainer has honestly been a godsend, which is why I also said, if we do not raise the $25,000, all the proceeds that are raised will go directly to the personal trainer because the personal trainer is $40 per session. Currently right now, I am not doing personal training because I am not putting any money from the bariatric surgery GoFundMe towards it until we reach a certain amount or possibly reach $25,000 for the surgery. Whichever happens, happens. Um, but I am not seeing the trainer at this time because I cannot afford it. So if we do not raise $25,000, I will put it to the trainer. I will go back to him and try and lose weight with him. But as of this time, I am not seeing the personal trainer. I saw him twice. He has helped me tremendously and I hope that he can help me in the future. But I just wanted to clear that up because I am getting some negative comments around that. And it kind of bothers me because I don't know why somebody would think that I would make this up. I mean, you guys see my size. You guys know my health problems. You guys know my history. I've told you guys everything so I don't know people are just negative just to be negative but I just wanted to clear that part of it up with that being said I have currently lost almost 30 pounds since the beginning of this month and that to me is phenomenal I mean I was 613 pounds when I started I am down to 585 that's almost 30 pounds and I'm grinding. I'm continuing to move forward as much as I can. I am on a 1500 calorie diet. The other day I sort of broke the diet and went to ate something, but then I threw it up right away. Yeah, that happened. My body rejected carbs completely. So I'm, I'm happy about that. My body is starting to get into the motion of eating healthy constantly. So I am really happy about that. Also guys, we're going to the gym. We've been grinding every single night. I've been doing up to 23 miles on the exercise bike. Yo guys, I just got off live stream. You guys pushed me to do 22 miles on the bike, but guess what? I'm doing another one, another one. So earlier I did 15 miles on the bike and I left and I went over and did the treadmill and I went over and did cardio and I came back. So it's gonna be a total of 23 miles once I hit eight, so fucking killing it, man. I'm gonna lose this weight in no time. I walked my first two miles the other night ever on the treadmill in like two years. First time doing an hour in like two years. First time doing over two miles in two years. Um, yeah, that's absolutely amazing. Honestly, I'm so proud of myself right now. So that's pretty phenomenal. 
and I'm just grinding as much as I can because I gotta get rid of this weight. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys already saw these clips. And I have a second Instagram, guys, which is dedicated fully 100% to my weight loss. It's Steve Fit Life underscore. So if you follow that, that is completely my fitness Instagram. I update that almost every single day. So you guys can follow my fitness goals and everything like that. Before we get into these video though, guys, I wanna let you guys know this video is partially new, partially old. So I uploaded a video a few months ago where there was these little mini claw machines and they were freaking amazing. And for some reason, I don't know if I did it or if it's a glitch, I don't know what happened, but the video is no longer there. The video is missing. And it was a really good video. It got like 20,000 views. It was, I mean, I really enjoyed it. I still have some of the clips on my Google photos that were saved from that day. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put new footage in this video and old footage in this video. If you guys already saw this video, watch it again. It's really pretty cool. I, it was one of my favorite videos. I probably deleted it myself by accident when I was going through old videos. I was deleting um, old live streams and stuff like that the other day and I might have clicked it by accident. I really hope I didn't. But guys, check out this video. It's, it's really cool. It's from about six months ago. Um, like I said, some of the footage is new, some of the footage is old, but hopefully you guys enjoy it. I'll see you guys at the end. It's a smaller pool. All right. And there's a pig. Hey. Six credits? What? Oh, dude. Uh, I got bamboozled. Uh, <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, I just got ripped <laughs> off, dude. I, I said, I oh. said you win it. It's a way you win. Oh. They Dude, I got robbed at the arcade. Hey, you have title hole? Oh, yeah, you literally. Are you over the big now? What a cow. What is with everything being like play till you win, dude? Uh, like really this needs to go away. No, I don't think it's a wall. I don't think it's a wall. I think it's just a personal opinion. I think it makes you more money. I think that's what they're uh, doing. It's is. horrible. Like I feel there's some type of way it get. I still can't win it. It's still weak. I feel like some way play till you win, you make more money. I have no idea, dude. I, I'm. I feel like I just got robbed, though. Honestly, <laughs> six credits. At least you like, win. For, like I don't want this for six credits. And it was strong when it wasn't. A <laughs> it was. Maybe they were getting ready for it. Let me go over to cow again, I guess. Oh no! I want the sloth. It's a sloth. There's a freaking sloth, dude. I want it. You just have to get it. This claw machine is like making kind of like, like. Oh! I'm staying. Oh! Oh my god. Wait, what if I get two and one though? Hold on. Yeah. At least I get my money's worth, right? I'm just saying. I mean, it's a weak hole as it is, and you're trying to push for two. Oh, the stars. Yeah, that's, no, there's a, there's a, one of these little things underneath it there. Oh, I didn't even see that. Oh, that? See? A free one? A none and none? A none and none. Okay. None and none. I ate it. That's scary. He said, where's my jacket? I said, I ate it. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna go for two. I, want sloth. Uh, I really want the sloth. No, the I mean, DMV. Uh, it doesn't. There we go. Mm. The DMV. Oh wait. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. This is it. I, I don't know. You're burying the sloth. <laughs> what, what if I get it like in the in the loop right there? I'm trying for two again. Screw it. And then you're gonna get something you don't. You're gonna get like the freaking. So I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get both of them. Oh, like that. Hold it. Uh, oh, no. I got both. I, I got oh, both of them. Yes. Yeah, you did. I got both of them. Yo, I so I got, I got kind of my money's worth, I guess. I thought it was about to be possible. I got a sloth. And All right, so you know one what? of them fire That's flower things. Whatsoever. Yeah, if you know what to do. Hey, our cable box. What do you got there? I don't know. I found this in the bathroom. <laughs> He's just walking around the arcade with my play button. We're gonna take some dope pictures, guys, for Instagram, so go check it out. Walk around the arcade with him. What's the problem? Okay. A silver play button. Getting people's reactions. So I got forty dollars on my cards, 160 tickets, and they've got these cool little like it's like police. Look at this. But it's like a cool little claw machine here, and you can win. Whatever they are, <laughs> narwhals, 
and it's like these little Japanese thing. They're, it's such a small little claw machine. So I'm gonna try this one right here. Try one of these little things right here. Let's see. Look how cute this is, dude. Oh my god, it's so little. Oh my god, I won! I won the first try. Dude, that's crazy. It's so cute. What is this? It's a a squish a squish squish mullows? That's really cool. It's so little. Look, guys. Look at this one. It's the tiniest claw machine ever. Like literally, it's so small. Look at this. I don't know what these are, but I'm gonna try and win one. I'm gonna go for that froggy right there. Oh my God, get it, get it. Oh, it's weak. It's weak. I'm gonna try this one here. They're so little, dude. Oh my God. All right. So we gotta go for something that's gettable. Like something like really gettable. I'm gonna go for this frog right here, right in the middle, right here. Right here. Get it, get it, get it. Uh, it doesn't grab it, but these are really cool. Like they're little claw machines. They're they're so small, but they're they're really expensive, but they're they're so small. Like dude, like look at look at how big I am and how little this claw machine. Like it's so I little. I don't see it. Where is it? Oh, <laughs> Wait, it is. if I stand in front of it, you can't see it. It's gone. It disappeared. It's so tiny, dude. It's so cool. And it's look, it's called a baby bear. It's a baby bear claw machine. Oh, I got babies <laughs> there. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go for a little narwhal here. But I can't even bend over that far, my God. I'm gonna go for a tiny little narwhal. I'm gonna go for the one right, oh, I can't go for the one right behind the shoe, so I'll go for this one right here. Here we go. Uh, it's not gonna grab, yeah, it's not, it's too, it's actually too small, I think. It's such a small little, oh my God. I wanna try and get it by the tail. See if I can get all, uh, can I get this one? I might be able to get this one right here. Let me try for that one. Ah, oh, I missed it. I missed it. All right, I'm gonna go for this narwhal. Oh, this one's seven. I think the claw's a little bit bigger, so I think you can actually get it. This is a bigger narwhal, or a bigger claw. Yeah, there we go. Let's see, grab it. Oh, I got it. I got the little narwhal. Look at that. Oh my God. That's awesome, dude. We got two little mini prizes from the little mini claw machines. They're so tiny, dude. It's like a little police truck. Look at this. It's a police truck. It's got blinking lights and everything. Look at this. This is so, I've never seen anything like this before in my life. This is probably the coolest little thing I've ever seen in my life. Like literally, it's awesome. So guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really, I really wanted to put this back out there because I enjoyed it. I had a lot of fun with our K-Boss that day and um, all the clips you saw were the clips that I had from before. And I wanna remind you guys that anybody that donates to my GoFundMe automatically gets a shout out in a video. And also guys, if you guys donate to my PayPal, which a lot of people have been messaging me asking me what my PayPal is, my PayPal is paypal.me slash claw boss if you guys donate to my paypal i will automatically shout you guys out on instagram and that'll be cool for you guys whatever you guys want your youtube channel your instagram whatever you guys want shout it out just leave it in the little comment section on paypal and i will shout you guys out also guys i have merch and i want to let you guys know that if you guys pick up the merch i will shout you out in a video i will put your picture right here somewhere on the screen in that video and I will put your Instagram or your YouTube channel or your Twitter or whatever you guys want shouted out. All you have to do, pick up the merch, tag me in a post on Instagram at ClawBossNJ of you wearing my merch. Just a picture of you physically wearing my merch. And I will put you in a video and shout out your channel just for buying my merch, guys. Because I want you guys to rock my merch. I want you guys to wear it to school. I want you guys to wear it around town. We have brand new merch. I call it my reckless clothing line. It is freaking insane, it's a whole new design. We have stickers, we have all kinds of stuff on the shop. The shop website is teespring.com slash store slash claw boss. Check it out, all t-shirts are cheap. I have the Reckless line on sale right now as we speak. I just want you guys to pick up the merch and start wearing it and start rocking it. So if you guys do that, you guys get a shout out. If you guys donate to my PayPal, you guys get a shout out. If you guys donate to the GoFundMe, you guys get a shout out. It's the least I can do for you guys helping me in my time of need 
and I appreciate everything you do. All PayPal proceeds go directly right back into the channel to help film and fuel future claw machine videos, arcade videos, so we can travel, go to new arcades, all that good stuff. So all your donations to PayPal help 100% this channel, and I appreciate everything you do. The GoFundMe is strictly for the surgery. I'm trying to raise $25,000. If we do not raise $25,000, I am going to put the money into the gym, into the personal trainer, so we can continue losing weight and continue on this path that we're on, but that's further down the road. So I'm gonna give you guys an update on my weight loss every single week. So every single Friday, you guys can look forward to an update to my weight loss. And hopefully by the end of this year, we will be down to 300 and, well, I will be down to 350 pounds. Thanks for watching guys, I'm Claw Boss, and I'll see you guys in my next arcade or claw machine video. Peace, guys.